Okay, I'm back in the Charles Boulevard location, and this is the manager. She always does a display. Um, she put multiple B items unrelated to this collection over here, like the porch leaner, the hanging sign. She made sure the B chair pads were front and center. And I don't remember them having chair pads with last year's collection, but I am surprised. All the stores I go to, this is not selling out. I guess people are over them, like me. I'm hoping to find the fruit-shaped sponges. I believe there's a lemon, and I'm not sure if it's an orange or something. Not seeing them here. I forgot to look when I was at Winterville. I found some towel clippers at Five Below, you, um, two pairs for a dollar, you know, for your beach chair or your pool lounger. Um, but I have used these. These work just as good to clip your uh, towels to your chair. So keep that in mind, if you didn't know. See, here's part of the new truck, and today is Tuesday. The truck came on Friday, and there's a lot of stuff. But I see the body wash. Here's the Peach Rings body wash. That sold out quick. Um, so it did circulate to a lot of the stores. Here's that new chivalry. Uh, aftershave so it's good that things are making their way around found these items in Zebulon the stampers they have hearts they have I guess that's like a flower pattern they have these butterflies and I believe stars I don't waste my money on these guys I have bought them before and never used them I did get the shadow stick this would be a great highlighter for travel if you you want to put a little highlight on and these lip glosses even though they're with the new items I feel like we've seen them before this for months since I tried it has been my everyday foundation this is really nice foundation so if you ever complimented me on my makeup this is what I've been using but since we got the Revlon I tried it and I love it and I'm hoping to find more maybe it's in those boxes down there but I'm not seeing any on the shelf this is the Be Pure um, sanitizer that I'm using to fill those containers. This is the only store in town that has any left. These also sold out. I guess people couldn't find the other one, so they grabbed these instead. I like it because it doesn't make my hands feel dry. When you're constantly washing your hands and using sanitizer, I hate dry hands. So um, if you get those empty containers, this is what I'm using. Guys, this fried rice was disgusting. It was horrible it ta it says plant-based it tastes like plants I mean and not fresh herbs and seasoning I gave them a chance again I told you I tried it once before I did not like it and the rice was like gummy I buy bagged rice 90 second bag rice all the time from other brands and they got it right I don't know why these people can't I do still have the cilantro and lime I do like cilantro and lime so I'm gonna try it with some tacos I mean I bought it for shits and giggles, I'm going to give it a try, but I don't have high hopes because this was absolutely horrible. Look at them mixing it in with the other foods. <laughs> I see you. I see you. Look, mixing them in. A1 sauce is back. It comes, it goes, it comes, it goes. I do like it and I do buy it. And I also buy the Heinz 57 periodically. I like it as well. I don't know if this sriracha hot sauce is in a bigger bottle. I'm used to seeing these size bottles, but they have um, sriracha hot sauce from Thai Authentic, and then they have the sweet chili sauce. So those look like they were freshly restocked because they had been gone from the shelves. Okay, guys, I'm on South Memorial, if you're local. They have their Juneteenth display in the front as you walk in. All of the signs and everything that I've seen in Winterville. The yard stakes. I don't think Winterville had the Juneteenth banner, but maybe they did. It's just saying this to myself in my head. That this store didn't get any of the twist products. But I'm seeing what I love. Is this the Boss Bounce? No. This is the other one. So I have found the Boss Bounce, but this is strengthened the bond. Oh, I'm so happy. 
Um, remember, I told you guys there's two different varieties. I found that out by watching Lady C's haul that she found, I think both of these actually, she actually found some things that I've never seen before. So I'm so happy. I'm so happy that I came here today because these are flying off the shelf. What this is, is this the ultimate moisture, deep hydration to nourish and restore curls. Um, yeah, so this is a hair mask actually. I did try the co-wash and I like it. So far, I like everything that I have found. Guys, this location has both. I thought I had uh, the hair mask in my cart. I picked up a few and I thought they all were the hair mask, but I had some of the Boss Bounce, which I have already. So you see how identical these containers look. They even have the same amount of moisture. So you just have to read and make sure. This is the product that I want that I don't have, the hair mask. Be on the lookout and I hope you find them. Ended up picking up the cow as well. I can't believe they have these security blankets. They are just the cutest. And the quality feels really, really good. Um, that really nice baby section, guys. A lot of options for baby shower gifts. Power Aid Sours are new. 50% more electrolytes. This is Blue Raz. Is it sugar free? Hell no. 21 grams. This is Sour Green Apple. This is Watermelon Lemon. Watermelon lime, I'm sorry. You haven't seen these before. And this is just a regular power aid. It's under the dollar twenty-five display. So I don't know. I thought power aid was one seventy-five. Seeing the mand mandolin uh, mini slicers in a couple of local locations. So if you didn't grab it and you're local, summertime's coming, salads, veggies. Uh, they're still around so that's good to know this store still has some boxes left of the lucky charm minis and i also was happy to find this fig spread upon your recommendations guys i will be trying it with some brie cheese it is so sweet so delicious i'm really happy that i'm still finding it on the shelf this location actually has everything they have the maple and brown sugar ham glaze and they also have the moroccan carrot spread which somebody also said that that was good so i hope if you're still looking for these guys you can find them um, i'm happy that they're still around also this organs kids protein shakes seeing them at this location i was questioning if this was a good deal for 125 per shake but somebody said that these are expensive and that actually is a good deal so if you're interested be on the lookout it has some vitamins and some minerals this location has the strawberry daiquiri drink mix along with the pina colada they restock the true lemon which is really good you can use that for not just your water but cooking anything that you need lemon it's dehydrated lemon they have the pure quick i'm not a fan of the citrus but i do like the uh strawberry watermelon some new fun fabric i don't think this is quite a fat quarter but it's 18 by 21 inches but bright colors for summer crafting they even have these with footballs on them haven't seen that before I so wish, I think I am going to give the Dollar Tree vinyl another chance. But uh, guys, when this, when I first got my joy, I went crazy. And I did return most of it because it just wasn't cutting well, even with adjusting the settings. But I did see some recent videos um, and uh, of people who had success that have the Cricut Joy. So I may try their iron on but i'm not finding the neon colors but other than that i'm not really seeing anything new they just restocked the um glitter glue sticks they have the fat tall glue sticks um and what else did i see that was new that was popping out at me they have these wooden dowels these are great if you want to make like um like those faux lollipops Christmas time. I wish they would have these Christmas time if you're doing the candy lane theme. There's a couple, a lot of things you can use that for. And I am going to look at their patches because you know I have that hat heat press. So 
Um, I am going to go through the iron on patches. Out of all of them, these are new. Haven't seen these before. Is that a sloth with the flowers? She's kind of cute. And the kitty, the panda, the heart, and the unicorn. Good if you're making something for a kid. Guys, in the stationery section, I think these binder clips are pretty cool. It has uh, Monday through Friday, and it also has to do urgent today, tomorrow, and a second to do in a different color. I think this would be awesome for your home office, for your business, for your work, to help keep you organized. If I don't show you guys, because I don't like to be repetitive, I do go down the toy aisle. I'm not seeing anything new with the girls' toys, but in the boys, I believe I hold these Minecraft figurines before this location is getting ready to have inventory yeah i did haul these before but if you've never seen them they have the mini minecraft figures and i believe i got them yes i did get them for chunk not sure if he's into minecrafts but he is into video games um so yeah these could just be taken out of the stock room but they do have those if you're local because they did sell out quickly at Winterville but I'm just peeking to see if there's anything new and these are standing out as new this make it blocks city so this looks like a park bench with the lights and uh, a mailbox it would be cool if it lit up but it doesn't they also have construction a construction play set and these aren't a lot of pieces this one is, I don't know, a dino, okay, a dinosaur. This is the same thing I showed you. And then this one is a traffic light. It looks like a motorcycle. And I don't know what that green thing is supposed to be. And then this is a little moped and a gas station. So summertime is coming. You may be looking for some inexpensive activities to keep them busy. And then this is just a construction site that looks like a crane. And they're all, nothing is, with the exception of the gas station, everything is under 40 pieces. So be on the lookout for those. They even have a storage container to keep the blocks. And that's all I'm seeing new. Just glancing through summer we've seen everything but you just never know if they drop something new but i think everything that we were going to see is here except my local stores didn't get the uh small like dip containers and it did not get the bowls with the dividers i don't know why but everything else is what we've seen still on the fence with the food trays i think they are the absolute cutest um, the chair pads are here. Yeah, we've seen everything. All right, I'm headed to the register for this location and maybe hit another one. Here local, I'm at the location on Greenville Boulevard across the street from the mall. This is another new twist product and a wish list find. This is on repeat, gentle oil infused shampoo, cleanse, nourish, revive, extra moisture for curls. This is another product that I have not found yet. To date, I think now I found, and no, I didn't. There's still more products. So there's a lot to this collection. I hope you guys are finding them. They've been around in the Dollar Tree streets for three weeks now, and um, I'm just finding them at this location. That's where these got smaller. These are the hot honey, Mike's hot honey chip, chips from Uts. I'm so upset, upset I can't even speak. These got smaller, y'all. Mm, mm, mm. Location also has the reusable bags. I thought they were like fish, but I don't know what they are. They're some kind of creatures. Again, I would not use those for food. I would use those for packing if you want to put toiletries and stuff like that. Sunscreen, stuff that you want to keep grouped together in a bag, but I would not use those for food. Really seeing the Tingly Ted's hot sauce. Um, it's not supposed to be that spicy. I did not think I would see this locally because I found it in Ollie's when I was looking for pickles. So I said, a lot of times when Ollie's gets something, we don't get it. <laughs> um, and I believe Ollie's had it for $1.50. So found it here at Dollar Tree for $1.25. I don't do spicy, but I'll get it for the house just to have. 
it looks like the Best Buy date. See, I would assume that was May 24. Or is it 24 of October 12? I don't know, y'all. I really don't know. I don't know. Should I get it? Should I let you guys try it first? And see if you guys live to tell the story? I don't know. I don't know if this is new or if they've always had it. It's from LA's Totally Awesome. It's a carpet spot and stain remover. Again, I'm not sure. Is it new? I don't know. And they also have the Love My Carpet Foaming Cleaner. And then they still have the Professional Foam Carpet Refresher, no vacuum needed, and it's pet fresh from Homebrite. I really found the shoe charms for your Crocs. They were on, they are on a clip strip by the register. There are four different varieties. So they have this foodie one, this one for the video game controllers, assorted sports balls, and they have this one. One says, have a nice day. It's a smiley face, a butterfly, and a shooting star. So we're at the large Kingston location. I don't know if their truck day was bumped up. My local store's truck day was bumped up to today, but they, I don't think, are ready because they're still putting away last week's truck. So I might not see new things uh, till Saturday, possibly. But we're going to go inside. I have zero expectations. Let's see what's new. New face mask, fine. Face mask, fine. Firming collagen face mask infused with pomegranate and caffeine from Bio Miracle. Um, have not seen this locally. So I will be picking it up. New face mask find guys from Bio Miracle. This is a firming collagen mask infused with pomegranate and caffeine. Haven't seen this one yet. This is new. Sonics Transformers toothbrush is new and I'm assuming this is Bumblebee. Not sure if they have other ones and we have seen the Rainbow Dolls one. Also I have seen the Butter on Gums toothbrushes from uh, Guru Nanda before, but haven't seen the Sonic Transformer toothbrushes. A recent haul, I hauled these 100 watt light bulbs and we put them in the kitchen and baby, they are super bright. 100 watt light bulbs, they're saying that it only uses 14 watts. The brightness is 1500 lumens. It is bright as hell. I think I'm wondering, is it almost too bright? So I'm gonna pick up the 75 watt. I broke a nail, so don't pay me no mind. But yeah, I'm gonna pick up the um, 75 watt ones and you get two bulbs. I really feel like we only used to get one bulb. And I will be picking up another one of these uh, $1.25 humidifiers. I hold one in gray and one in pink. And my sister watched my video and she said, get me one. I said, what color? She said, blue. So this is for her. In Virginia, I found the blue extension cord. And I found the black one. They didn't have the pink. Get in my cart. I will use this for my work bag. Really seeing the grill tray heat resistance up to 518 degrees it's 11 by 14 inches you get a two pack I haven't seen this um, locally it is on the end cap with the other barbecue accessories I've restocked the air fryer liners in both sizes they have the 15 count ones and the smaller uh, 20 count ones. I have not seen these anywhere. Lucked up and found one pack. I did order from Timu, but I don't know how I'm going to like these. And I know that I like these, so I'm going to pick them up. As always, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you guys have a great Friday. Happy Memorial Day weekend. I'll see you in the next video.